My name's Gareth Ansel, and I'm the Deputy Managing Editor at Disneys.com. This special video is brought to you by RMB. It's been an interesting three days here at the World Economic Forum for Africa and Durban. This is the final third day, and I've got some closing thoughts about what we've witnessed over the last few days. I've had lots of interactions with many executives and even government people, and the one overriding theme that jumps out at me is that Yes, Africa has lots of economic opportunities, it has a young population, it has the ability to really take off. But the problem is, is that the baseline infrastructure and systems just aren't really there. We still need better roads, we still need better educated people, we need a proper skilled workforce that can really take advantage of the likes of fourth industrial revolution type technologies such as drones. And the key question is, how is Africa going to solve this problem? How is it going to close that gap? It's easy for delegates to come here and talk about what needs to be done. The path looks pretty clear, but the question is, where is the action going to come from? Can governments actually deliver? Because it's really got to be government that's going to deliver better educated people, infrastructure, etc. Business then will come in and play its part and help to grow further revenues. So those are the key questions that I think a lot of delegates are going to walk away with from this particular conference. And we'll have to wait until next year and the year thereafter to see if anything actually really happens. Thank you very much for joining us over the last three days. It's been a pleasure bringing this video to you. And um, cheerio. Cheers.